Hi, yo. Yeah, again, uh, we should reiterate that this tournament by Asuma is at a rugby stadium in Kansai. It's actually technically the King of Fighters Stadium. Yeah. From DLC pack number two? One. One. Never mind. I don't know anything about this game, so let's get into <laughs> this. <laughs> King of Fighters is better than rugby anyway. Yeah, I think so too. I'd rather be playing King of Fighters than, than playing, yeah. Yeah. You know, get real concussions. <laughs> <laughs> Hang out with a bunch of greasy English dudes who sound like they're who sound like they're speaking English but they doesn't sound like English. No, it sounds like Yoshi Dora when he is popping off. Uh he's not popping off now he's popping off. Just a, just a tad oh man if he got that narrow any of that Diddy would be dead. There's just something about this guy. He's just so aggro. He's so aggro. It's stifling. It's like the end of One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, you know, when he stifles the guy. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, like, he knows exactly when to kind of hang back in his uh, little egg shield. But at the same time, though, he, he does stuff like that, and it's just like, hey, guess what? I can do this. That's uh, such a crazy option because, A, the egg covers where you're going. B, if you try to get out of the way, you burn your resource, and he's trying to cover where you go after the egg, and C, if it hits you, it's confirmed. Yep. It's such good option coverage at the ledge there. This is why b the people call Yoshidoya the uh, the alien. This guy does not play like he's from, like he's a mortal man. He's from out of this world. He, you know, other aliens come to the world, and he says, no, this planet has already been conquered. <laughs> and uh, they leave. By a dude named Yoshidoya. Yeah, that was a really cherry air dodge too to get back man he is extending this stock was that was that the melee yoshi tricks where he's like egging from the ledge yeah yeah really good just to kind of like get some uh, slow the thing pace down until you can figure out a way to get back into back into the action oh man did he love to hit that up he out of shield but not gonna work here Oof. oh my goodness yeah if he intercepted that with a nair he would have been out of there uh, okay. okay, that was that was just a desperate forward smash, but that's a good monkey monkey flip. Yeah, monkey flip will KO at that percent. I think at like 150 will start to KO. Dude, so aggro. Yes, yeah. dude does not rest. We do not miss your text, uh, man. That, <laughs> that 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 was free. Yeah, and that nair comes out frame three, so it's really hard to react to and to you know realize you are being getting put into a tech situation. So yeah. it is easy to miss. I've missed it quite a bit myself. Okay, nice. Tech. Yeah, now now he knows. Yeah. It's like okay, I learned I learned it once. Tech check. Yeah. yeah it's just sad he had to lose. Uh, Koshika Kushi, had to lose his stock for it. Yeah, Koshika. Koshika. Stock down, but you know he's learning the matchup best he can. Yeah, you like you better be a fast learner because this guy. This guy, Yoshidora, is a menace to society. Absolutely, and there's, I don't know, I don't think there's a lot of Yoshis at his level that you can practice against, right? It's kind of like the Hungry Box phenomenon where we just don't know how to play against this character. Yeah. Oh, man, I like that zoom on Yoshi's face when he did the back air. <laughs> it was such an aggressive look on it <laughs> Yoshi. It is. It's like the Luigi depth stare. Yeah. That's so good. Oh, man, I miss the Luigi. I haven't played Mario Kart in so long. Should get on that, but um, wow! So that was a pretty commanding game one from Yoshi Dota. I would say so. Yeah, he was all over him. It was very different from what we saw with Kojika versus Dio, where Dio was very content to like you know ah. lay back, cook grenades, start yeah. the Rachel Ray cooking show. Yeah, yeah, he was very content. Dio was content to play lame. Yoshi Dota does not does not play that. He doesn't understand that word. Yeah. I'm sorry, sorry. Well, I came here to I came here to combo you, and yeah. I'm all out of bubble gum. I came here <laughs> to just <laughs> stay stay on there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like Yoshi bought his NFTs, and now he's trying to get someone hacked them. Now he's trying to get them back. Oh, <laughs> uh, I love I love the different ways we go with this because I was thinking he's like that one guy at the club who's just like way too aggressive with the Diddy Kong. He's like, hey, hey, can I have your number. And he's like, no, <laughs> get off me, throwing bananas at him. I know a few promoters. Apparently, that, that was like how the club was the other night. Oh boy, you throwing bananas at people? Uh, apparently, that was that's what that was happened at the club the other night. I, I stayed home. Okay, good to know. But yo, you know who's not? Who you know who wish they stayed home? Koji got <laughs> Diddy Kong off stage. This is yeah. He might be going home here in a minute if he can't do anything against this against this uh, freak of nature Yoshi. Absolutely. But good thing he remembered his banana spray. Okay. Wait. 
Dunk. That was a really e. good wave dash out of egg. <laughs> that's an option, by the way. People don't do that too much. Yeah, see, that's what I like about Yoshido's play, is that he will, doesn't matter, you go high, you go low, Yoshido is there. Yeah. Yeah, he's like Bon Jovi. I'll be there for you and with the fair. It's, it's the Terminator. Absolutely. You cannot get away from this guy. Or the sequels, the sequels being game number two, game number three. Yeah, yeah hopefully they, we don't go to game four because Terminator. That was not a great film. Everything passed. And is that Terminator 2 for me? I, know, I think Yoshi Dota agrees. Yeah, I think so. I think he's trying to make a quick Terminator 2 out of this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Round number two. Oh, my God. Oh, the armor. <laughs> yeah, that's a multi-hit move. You can you can hit armor through the one that hits. That is that's absurd, man. Okay. That's what we call a character specialist knowledge. Absolutely, but you know, yeah. everyone gets one. But that was two up smashes. Okay, nice monkey flip in to just you know get under the jump. I don't think that was aggressive at all. I think he was just trying to get back in center stage. Yeah, because as we've like. As soon as you're in the corner, <gasps> that happens. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. Yoshi, Yoshi was like, that was for you to see, man. That's that was, oh, oh, shit. Yo, he like <laughs> swung the baseball bat and called it out. Like, this one's the coming here. This English coming here. So let's go. Yeah. Yeah, this one's going straight, straight in outfield. Oh, this one's straight out of the rugby park. We're getting yeah. a home run. Hot <laughs> dog. That was a good pairing. Not a good pairing. I know baseball. I don't know, I don't know anything about rugby. <laughs> but I. I think I don't think uh, Koji Kaya knows how to deal with this Yoshi. Yoshi Dora looking like he wants to steal second base here. He's trying to work it on this tool stock. Yeah. yeah tool stock. Okay. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. There we go. There we go. Some damage on the table for Koji Kaya. These eggs are up menacing. You cannot land against this guy. Beautiful stuff from Yoshi Dora. He just he knew. That wasn't a read. He just knew. This has got to be the best Yoshi in the world. Hard agree. It's so entertaining to watch. It is. It is. What What would you compare it to? I could compare it to like, because you always know that like, there's that one player in your your hometown or your region. Like he, he's like insanely good, but he just never gets to travel for whatever reason. Oh yeah. Because we all have that one guy who just never leaves like their home state, but they just always take it to their playmate. Like they're uh, always take it when they go to like a regional or whatever. And they just never sleep. That reminds me of Locust in Texas. He used to play Ryu and Smash 4, Ridley in this game, yeah. and then Banjo. And he just, he does not travel because he cannot sleep if it's not his bed. Uh, I know that feel. So, like, what's the point of, like, going to tournament if you can't sleep? Right. Yeah, like, Yoshijora, like, like, like no disrespect, no, we don't mean any disrespect to our, our, our guy, uh, Koji Kayo. No, not at all. But, it's like, uh, he's... Anytime Koji Ka has, like, he thinks he has an answer, Yoshi Dora changes the question. Absolutely. I think that's the way I would put it. Yeah, it's like, who wants to be a millionaire? But there's like eight multiple choice and they're constantly shuffling the board. And Koji Ka is just trying to guess right. You know, for $1 million, it's probably not going to work out for him. Yeah. Can't count him out here, though. He is trying to make magic happen right now. Okay, he's got the Spike Lee Spice. Oof. Oof, but up there, yeah, that Double is gonna. Up jeez, dude, the air mobility from Yoshi, he <laughs> just like floats with you. Combos him. Oh, monster up smash. Yeah, like honestly, I, I wasn't too hot on Yoshi uh, in this game for a while, but then I think Yoshi Dora kind of awakened the uh, potential that this character has. He awoke in a sleeping dragon. He is, he's like the Amsa. Smash Ultimate. Yeah, which is funny because Yoshi's uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Dora here is playing the blue Yoshi, but Amsa, uh, Amsa <laughs> plays the red Yoshi. So. Very true. They are polar opposites. But yet, Yoshi Dora is he like you know, Amsa can play, play pretty collectively, pretty cool. Yoshi Dora does not know that word. He is. <laughs> He holds forward and it works. I was just going to say, like, have you ever seen him hold back in this? Over the entirety of this set, has he held back at any point? Ooh. Oh my god, this man! This man! He's <laughs> I love that expression, D. Kind of like, I, I really got hit by that. He doesn't know how to chill. Like, this guy will go to the sauna and just be, like, freaking out about his day plan okay. the whole day. This guy right, good there. never likes good up, B. This is a kill option at the ledge for Diddy, so good stuff. Yeah. He's trying to sit on him again. Yeah. 
We might see him mix up where he tries to sit on him center stage. We haven't seen him go for that in neutral. I don't think he needs to. Like his moves are just so good without it. He only goes for it at the ledge as like a trump or a, a catch option. Yeah, or like just he just needs to grab the ledge. Yeah, I don't see him like really going for that unless it's like a real desperate or real real hard read because that could be a big punish if. It doesn't work. I don't think we're going to see that high of, of a high read at this level. Like, yo, Kojika kind of getting swept. It's not that bad. He's keeping it competitive. Definitely. Yeah, he's definitely, um, I guess, awakened to Ben this third game. By the same time, though, it's Yoshida on game three. You got to 3-0 this guy if you're going to make it out of this set, my man. Winner's yeah. round eight. Your time might have come. Your time is up. My time is now. I forgot the words of the song. It's okay. We know them in our hearts. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Banana gonna end him with the fruit salad into the nice. mix. Yup, that's beautiful. I like, I like to call that the fruit salad yeah. combo. <laughs> Down tilt up smash. It's looking like the Wiggles out here. Yummy, yummy. Okay. Oh yeah, shout out to my, my boy Wig Wiggle. I don't think he's watching, but happy birthday, dude. Happy birthday, my man. And here we are. Ooh, that was a really safe bear on the shield. The reverse yeah. hit of bear on Yoshi's shield. That's the only one thing, uh, one unique trait about Yoshi is that cannot be shield poked. Cannot be shield poked. I, uh, I'm very glad they took out the, uh, or added the ability to jump out of shield for Yoshi, though. He can't jump out of shield? No, in this game he can. In, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In Melee and Brawl he couldn't. Oh, right. Yeah, that was quirky. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oof. So... That's one thing about Yoshi Dodo, though. He he never not lands with a button. It's very true. He he holds in so hard, and you know I would I definitely. I mean, far be it for me to criticize uh, how Yoshi plays, but it'd be cool to see him go for like some more empty jumps. Do you think that really works for Yoshi? Because think about it, Nair, so safe, and his jump is kind of he's floating a lot. You know, he doesn't like jump down like Fox really quick in front of you. Um, I just feel like if you're getting parried a lot, because we're seeing uh, uh, Coach Kayo get a few oh parries. Oh my god, you see that combo? Sorry yeah. to interrupt you. Yeah, okay. you're, you're absolutely right about the parries. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I think Koji Kayo is fighting, um, fighting the answer. He's fighting his demons here. Yeah. He is He's trying so hard not to get rushed down by Fox Yoshi. Yeah. He really plays it like Captain Falcon. Like, he's a Captain Falcon player. In a Yoshi's body. Yeah. <laughs> He's like uh, our mutual friend, uh, Elix. I don't know if Elix is watching. Because, you know, he doesn't, like, he doesn't like to, he always holds forward. Absolutely. And it works It works out for him. I'm trying to, I'm really trying to understand. Because the thing about Kojika Yoshio, he's really good at, like, holding back with punishing you, right? Mm -hmm. So how, how, how in God's name is this Yoshi just holding forward on it? I lay it on me. What was I, 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 okay, it's he uh, like all of his buttons. He's always coming out with a button, but it's never like the same button. Like he sometimes he's going for an air, sometimes he'll drift back and just intentionally with a back air. Like he's really good at mixing up what he's coming in on you with. Very, very true. We saw it right there. Like even though it was the same move, Nair, like he did it in front of his shield, he did it behind his shield. He started behind, landed behind, started behind, landed in front. Like the Nair mix-ups for this character kind of carry it as a whole. Yeah, unfortunately, like we've seen a few punishes. Like sometimes he'll get a parry and just tries to do something, or Koji Kai, I should say. But again, Yoshiro is starting to like mix up the timing. And mix up the approaches. Very true. It is. It's kind of infuriating to see how how much Yoshi Dora can get away with on your shield. Another thing is that he's uh, since he's always at a range where he, not necessarily correct, but could just be in an area where you don't want him to be. You don't really have the time to like really like breathe. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is Diddy Kong. He's, you know, one thirteen and still trying to catch his breath here. Going into... But no, 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 I confirm. What could potentially be the killing yeah. blow here? What a vicious throw, man. Have you ever seen someone do that in real life? Just, uh, blah. 
I've seen some throws. I've seen some you spills. I've never seen anyone do that in real nah, life. Ah, no, Yoshi's one of a kind. Alien man coming he's through here. He's built different. Absolutely. He's a genetic freak. <laughs> Wait. I like to see it. I would like to see Koshika go for the bear confirm. It's really not that hard. And you can mix up their DI. <laughs> <laughs> he just came in and just did it. Jeez. You know what? I've been thinking. I've been playing a little bit more recently. Yeah. I've been playing Smash Bros. since like 2005 in tournaments. Mm. I still don't know what to do whenever people come down with their invincibility. <laughs> That's a great question. It's something that I practice actually quite a bit because I think like if I can take their stock, wait out their invincibility, and then get into advantage and hit them, that is a huge lead, right? So players who can do that are really good. Oh my god, what is that this was, nair train? Four nairs in a row. Absolutely. He just kept tech chasing him with short hop nair. Oof. This character is ignorant. I don't care what you say. This is. <laughs> <laughs> I love. Thank you for using my word, Shaky. The uh, the ignorance. Dude, I got that from zero. No cap. Uh, ignorante. He's he can't do anything here. He just doesn't care what you do. Yep. Yeah, but that said, like Koji Kaya has been. Um, try to read a roll. He's definitely f fighting something here because. Even though Yoshiro has been always been the aggressor, uh, Kaya has been getting these hits like this. Wants to ref smash. That is like a very scrub beginner move that you see at the low levels quite a bit. Like you usually don't see Diddy just land a raw banana at top level, right? <laughs> Gonna. There we go. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Three frames. Can we get the PG stats on how many times he's narrated? Because I'm pretty sure it's like 70% yeah. of his moves. Jeez, fourth or a ledge. He is just absolutely making a jump and just moving out. This guy, nice high recovery. Yeah, that's what we call that. Some, some movement going on. Yo, Rachel Ray, take notes. Oh, oh my <laughs> god! Kochi got <laughs> playing his heart out! Kochi did not want to do it with any of that. No, nah. I just... He's like, I don't f I don't feel like it. I, I enjoy it. Dude, that was the, the hand warmer coming through. Beautiful stuff coming through yeah, here. Oh, uh, that, yeah, you're right, the hand warmer. <laughs> yeah, gonna yeah. One thing about Yoshi, no good kill throw. Kochi Kai, you... You better figure out... You better... You Better put him down now. Koji Kai is actually making me, I don't know, feel some kind of special right now. This I have not seen Diddy play like this before. He's playing so well. I guess Koji Kai's answer is like, hey, you're going to hold forward? I can do the same thing. <laughs> I, I also got fast as heck buttons. It's true. It's absolutely true. Like I also got the mobility. Diddy can be just as ignorant about the test scores as you can. We. Oh, I'm sorry. You were only minus five on shield? Well, how about this down smash? <laughs> yep. So, Yoshi at a kill percent. You can obviously say uh, Koji Kai's already buffering the down tilts. Okay, okay. He had to go out a little bit further for that one. Yeah. Yoshi Dora did not believe. Okay. Yeah, with punish. Wow, that is huge. You know, I, Splat. I keep saying he should go for the bears, but he's just making so much money off of down tilt up smash. This man. Yeah, I guess. Especially at center stage, because they were at center stage right there. Be right. Better go for the up smash. That was an up smash moment. Yeah, I mean, just in general. And especially, like, what do you think is harder? Do you think the uh, down tilt back air is kind of hard to do? Because you have to do more inputs, because you have to do a raw bear. Yeah, I think with Slingshot coming out, it's a lot easier now. Um, I'm not a great player. I hit it very consistently. I actually have a harder time hitting down to the up smash because really? the, percents, uh, the percents are hard to know. So sometimes you can hit them before they die and you steal your up smash. And then they fall out of the, the confirm range. Mm -hmm. Or you hit them too late and then you don't get the kill. Looks uh, like we're looking at a replay. No, nope, this is no. We're just straight into it. We haven't updated the score, but for yeah. everyone watching at home, it is now two two. two. Game number five here at Mysma Top. Up. Yeah, so we're gonna see with some. Because uh, Yoshida was in control those first two games, and in the beginning of that third. second, that third game as well, right? Yeah, but uh, looks like uh, Koji Kai, Koji Kai has found. He's found something. Oh, he has found the secret sauce. He's blocking these eggs. Oh, my God. Okay. Try to hit him with the banana, the the kebab. I'm sorry. You just had a kebab, didn't you? I just had kebab. <laughs> I don't know why I thought. I don't know. What, what kind of dishes involve bananas? The the Sunday? Sundays are good. Uh, 
like oh, a, like, yeah. a, like a good chocolate banana protein shake. That was a great analogy, and that was an even better egg lay attempt <laughs> coming out. But ooh, Splat. the fruit salad <laughs> off the top. I love, how, I, I love how I love how like when Yoshi hits the screen, he just looks so hurt. <laughs> <laughs> it's so it's so funny. <laughs> yeah, you know, every time Mario jumps off a of Yoshi and he dies in like the Mario game, yeah. that's what's happening. Yeah, he just he just at two Brutus. Oof. Okay, I'm gonna get a small two pace here. Yeah, because that's one thing about Yoshidoro's aggression is that because he's always at 11, he doesn't know how to tone down. Because I feel like... Oof, there we go. <laughs> instant double jump. You can get that within the instant double jump. That is amazing. Yeah. But I was going to say, uh, sometimes you got to tone it down to like 8 or 9. You don't have to be at 11 all the time. I don't know. Tell that to Yoshidoro, this man in winner's round 8 right now. Going game 5 against Kojika. Because now, now Kojika is going up to 11. It's true, it's true, it's true. Especially with his his upbeats, I do not see Diddy's go for these aggressive upbeats off stage where they try to hit you with the back of the burner, and oh my god. Yeah, it's good because it does just a grip of damage and knockback. Mm. And if you can just burn Yoshi's double jump, then hey, you've won the battle. It's something oof, you cannot. Yoshidora is kind of like Ken Sonic in that way that he will always go for drop zone fair. All right, good command grab. Oh, consistently wave dashing now the egg lay. I really appreciate that coming out from Koji Cobb. Let's see if he can make it down. But egg roll. Kind of, who, who, who does that? <laughs> no one, no one does that. Even Diddy Kong was like, oh, come on, I got hit by that. Shout out to Tobu for laughing at me for saying that's a move that people use. Which move? The egg roll. I mean, Yoshida did it. It's definitely a movement option, like a super unexpected game five <laughs> no, movement option. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, splat. Yeah. I would see if we can get three splats in a row. Oh, man, I'd love another splat. Splatfest? <laughs> hey, splat two three is coming out soon. Yeah. Nice. Okay, so now I can see Yoshida going down to, like, you know, toning it down just a little bit. But that, that said, it's now turned down for what? <laughs> exactly, and here we are coming back to the ledge. I right. really like the banana Kashi. Koji Kayoshio, you better turn it up right now. Dude, can we talk about ignorant Nairs? Because he did three in a row and still got the Yoshi hot dog. Here we are. Ooh, good egg. Oh, I love that banana placement. Nice. Yeah, that was a really good call on the monkey flip there. Oh Oy. my god! Oh, we got the first blast! <laughs> <laughs> yes! Oh my god! <laughs> that was tic-tac-toe, uh, but not the way you think it goes. <laughs> that was so... <laughs> that was epic. Oh man, I love it. That was so good. Okay. Did they, did they add that for Ultimate or was that for a Smash 4? That was in Smash 4 as well. I don't know. I, I, I just think it's so funny. It's so much better now. So uh, people in the chat, there's only two days. This is the final day. And Ah, that, that, was, <laughs> that was awesome. C-Mangs, what can I say? I don't think it gets better. Can you imagine a better set than that? 